first of all, thanks everybody for being here today. Parents, you obviously are demonstrating the idea of what's important in your homes, and by the fact that you're here, um, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. El, uh, uh, buenos días a todos. El director le quiere agradecer a todos los padres por venir hoy. Uh, le agradece mucho que tomaron el tiempo para venir a ver a sus hijos en esta ceremonia de hoy. And I'm so proud that this year we have three newcomers to the United States that have seen that and they said, I want to be a part of that. And this year they're a part of our NGRO to see and they're learning alongside with you what it means to show commitment, honor, success, and what NGRO to see is all about. And that's because of the example that you provided and the long history that Santa Ana High School has had with us. So thank you and continue keeping up the good work. So I thank you from, the, from my office, from the staff across the district, um, and from, I thank the commanders and the staff here who, who work with you every day. Because it's, it's hard work, it's commitment, and you do a darn good job every day you come to school. So thank you, thank you, thank you for being a model for the other kids in the district and the other younger kids who will come behind you. Thank you. Congratulations for making Orange County and Santa Ana High School a better place by dedicating over thousands of service hours back to the community. 3,600 hours. That's amazing. Your efforts have made a difference to the people you serve. The skills you are learning through this program not only help you with the inspection today, but we'll also help you succeed in high school and beyond. All I got is Jay Martinez. Is there a Martinez in that platoon right there? Oh, Josie, come on up, Josie. And uh, Ali Martinez. Yeah, good job, Ali. Um, okay. Every one of you guys in the color guard got outstanding by the colonel, so. We're going to have to start calling him Santa Claus. So, you guys stand, stand tight there, okay? Yureli Chavez, Karen Garcia, Mariana Salinas, Sasha Silva, Cindy Vargas, Nayeli Vasquez, uh, Aureli Franco, Nelly, Nelly, you know who you are, Behina. Uh, Veronica Gutierrez, Kira Rodriguez, Grandma, raise your hand. Hey, Grandma, Kira got it. Um, mi nombre es Aide Mena Brito. Uh, me gusta la disciplina que tienen aquí con todos ustedes y pues los felicito a los que los entrenan a ustedes y el esfuerzo que hacen aquí para para que los ayuden un día de mañana a este, escoger la carrera que vayan a escoger ustedes. Y me gusta mucho esto. Mi nombre es Carete Arisbe Alonso y a mí me gusta este porque muchas veces que está enseñándome cómo hacer disciplina y para, para, para hacer un buen futuro para mí y para la nación. What is one of the things that you think that you gain from being in ROTC? Uh, the things that I like to be in, in ROTC because even though even though it's hard. But you have to you have to have hope in yourself that never letting yourself down by anything or anybody. Can uh, can you give us your name? I'm uh, uh, Chris Michelson. I think I think the the big benefit of the Junior ROTC program is an ability to, in a very safe environment, uh, get to know your fellow classmates, practice leadership, fail in a very safe way and learn about what our nation has for people to do, uh, and that is to be naval officers if that, that showed, if, it, if that takes them in that direction. But what I think more importantly than anything else is it's gonna teach them you know, to be more disciplined in their academics and hopefully be better, get better grades. It's gonna teach them physical fitness. Okay, they're gonna get out there and they'll do the mile and a half run, they're gonna do pull-ups. But what I think and more than anything else is gonna teach them is to be a good citizen. It's gonna teach them the moral fiber of what we want all of our citizens to be able to do, which is to be persons of good character. And I will tell you, Tom, your organization is phenomenal. I was very impressed. I saw 70, about half of the, half of the cadets. 
Every one of them had a smile on their face. Every one of them was excited to be here. And I said, hey, if you're a first sergeant for a day, what would you do? And they were all excited. And, and you just have a strong, positive command climate. I just wish you the very best. And I think that you do have a very high character in terms of your, your, your team here. And I think that they are well on their way to being fabulous citizens. So thank, thank you. you thank you very much. Thank you very much. Well, my name is Diana, and what I like about it is that they actually do work on their students. They do learn hard work. They uh, honor and commitment in this in this uh, program. How do you see the behaviors of the? Oh, it changes a lot from beginning to end. I've been in it. My sister's been in it, and my youngest sister's in it now. And um, how did it, it help you when you got grown up more? Uh, it, it made me more outspoken, more confident. And it actually made me more more responsible, and as an adult. And I really hope they do the same thing with our future students. My name is Valentin Estrada. I'm a former former um, cadet here. I gradu graduated um, this year, 2016. Um, what I did in ROTC was uh, I was an officer, Lieutenant JG. I was an officer. Um, my my work was to do gardening and well this program helped me a lot because they show you leadership friendship like right now they're doing making some noise and and mostly like like all the units like a family to family how do you think it helped you when you grew out of school and you're on your own um it helped me in a way like um like not to, that i know i'm not gonna be alone when i like when i get out when i'm by myself like right now i'm going to college and right now I'm just focusing on studies and study more for the ASVAB to join the military. And what do you think about the mural inside? Oh, uh, the mural is pretty nice. It's it's new. I never seen it before, but it's I saw it today. But it's really nice. It's colorful. First time they've done it.